We are starting to get to the nitty-gritty now. Only four teams remain alive in the cup, and the scene is set for what should be an exciting semi-final. Who will make it through? Stay tuned, we'll have all the action for you live here on EA TV. Hello and a warm welcome on what is a glorious night for football. Perfect playing conditions. I'm Derek Ray in the commentary position and I'm joined for expert analysis by my partner Stuart Robson. And we're at a very important stage of this cup competition, the semi-final stage. Stuart, how do you see this one going? Well, what a matchup between these two excellent teams. Both have played really well to reach this stage of the tournament. But which one is going to go through to the final? I think this could be really close today. Here's how it looks for Portugal. Bruno Fernandes plays alongside Vitor Ferreira in central midfield. And leading the line today is Cristiano Ronaldo. This is what they'll be up against today. Well, they're going to play with two wingers here, but I'm just a little bit worried that the centre forward could become isolated. Therefore, the midfield players need to get forward as much as possible in this 4-3-3 shape. And the contest begins. Malaka. Plenty of players waiting in the middle. He cuts it back. Well, the keeper wasn't worried in the slightest. Ruben Dias on to Silva and Bernardo Silva has it will he finish? well it didn't really go according to the script did it? well the less said about that the better because that's a really poor attempt in the end Well, Rafael Leao, the sort of player who, on the one hand, entertains, but also delivers. What might he contribute today? Well, Derek, over the years, he scored so many goals. It's his ability to come short and then spin in behind defenders at such pace. When the ball's played in behind, nobody catches him, and he often gets 1v1 against the goalkeeper, and we know what the result is. down but credit to the defense Bernardo Silva it's with Joao Cancelo Fernandes and here's Cancelo Ronaldo There to take it away. 
Ronaldo striding forward with confidence. Ronaldo! And a goal! The opening statement of the semi-final. How important could that prove to be? Well, I won't get tired of watching this. It's an outstanding bit of play. Just look how far he runs with the ball. That's a great goal. And back underway. 1-0 it is. Excellent refereeing. Advantage in operation. Well, sometimes advantage just doesn't work out. And the referee has awarded a free kick now. Oh, great vision. Difficult to stop him. And they'll get ready for the throw-in. Good defending to stop a decent looking attack. And the counter attack is on, options available. Beautiful pass. Well, it petered out. A foul, but advantage played. Smuggled away. Promising sequence. Could play it in. Well, it looked promising, but the keeper taking command of the situation. Well, attacking possibilities, but it fizzles out thanks to that piece of defending. Bruno Fernandes has it. Well, high marks for that pass. Towards Bernardo Silva. Well, clattered away. Oh, could be. And a goal! They've extended the lead. Well, plenty of time remaining. This is far from over. But they're well on course for a place in the final. Well, as you can see, he gets everything right here. What a skillful volley that is. So underway again, and a 2-0 advantage here. Joao Cancelo. Now with Silva. Pepe, Rafael Leao, and Palinha with it. Couldn't hang on to it. Nice looking pass, an alert intervention. Well, I have to say, this is a really good goal. Just watch his technique here. He just hits through the back of the ball with such power. There's no stopping that. Well, as they kick off again, 2-1 the current state of affairs. Well, doesn't have to do it on his own. Takes it on. The keeper diving magnificently to make sure he got there. Behind in the game, but now they have a corner. Last man back, and job done. And it wasn't taxing for the keeper. So a throw in here. How about the cross? And the cross not quite accurate enough.
Ferreira. Here's Ronaldo. And a good looking pass. Ronaldo. He'll take this on. Well, we gave it the big build up, but he didn't quite deliver on his promise. Well, on you go, says the referee. Advantage. And a tidy challenge. And he's in. And the goalkeeper has outdone himself with that save. Played over. And did his job defensively. Well, not coming close to hitting the target from there. Well, there is going to be stoppage time, but only the one minute. How can he take them on and beat them? And the whistle is sounded for half-time in this game. So, into the second half here, Portugal with the advantage, but absolutely no room for complacency. That's a well-struck pass. Bernardo Silva. Shaping to shoot. Well, very effective goalkeeping to touch it over. Well, maybe scope for Portugal to add to their lead with this set piece. Delivering it. Clearance needed to be better. Fernandes. Long-range effort. Well, just off target, but it goes down as a chance to extend the lead. Well, it was a decent effort, but in the end, not quite good enough, was it? Well, there to intercept. Benjamin Sheshko. Fantastic work to thwart the danger. And the counter-attack is on. Options available. Good ball over the top. And quick thinking defensively. Cesco. Well, it's a good-looking position. Is there a goal in the future? Will he play it in? And defending as a unit. Oh, nice work to get past his opponents. Well, in there to tidy up. A bit of running room now on the wing. Decided to take on the shot from a difficult angle. Not a memorable effort, though. Well, you have to question the decision-making there. Could he have cut it back? The angle was always against him. Ferreira. Good-looking pass. Giving them a different option by moving in field. Firing it in and keeping it out. Substitution time it is here. Playing it in. Was it a great clearance? And play halted, free kick given. Cesco. A 
I'll tell you what, it wasn't a million miles away from the equaliser. Well, it was a decent chance, but they're still behind here. They needed to take that one. And the substitution will occur now. Pressure applied. Can they make something of it? Vitor Ferreira. On the ball, Rafael Leao. Bad challenge. And now it's up to the referee in terms of what to do next. And he does produce the yellow card. Yeah, it certainly deserved a yellow. It's a poor challenge, you have to say. Bernardo Silva going well and an opportunity here for Portugal to extend their lead and he's fired over the corner well as a defender that will sit you down to the ground giving it a try well, no degree of difficulty for the goalkeeper they're behind but they might be onto something here and just like that they don't have the ball anymore that's a splendid ball from Ronaldo as nice for goal is it going to be and that a piece of goalkeeping you're going to see again and again and again and time for the change now Played over. Oh, that's not a good clearance. Oh, that surely had to go in, but marvellous defending. The referee is given a corner. Can he deliver it with accuracy? Oh, a smart stop. <laughs> Delivering it. No nonsense piece of defending. Ilicic. Counter-attacking chance. Benjamin Sheshko. Oh, managing to beat him. Can he put it away? Well, the keeper in position to prevent another goal from him. Well, he's a massive threat. That really could have been his second goal there. A strong goalkeeping after the corner had been delivered. Pedro Neto. eventually goalkeeper's ball well you can sense the relief amongst his teammates but what a first save that was there might very well be late excitement five minutes left and the margin just one nice looking pass and he keeps going textbook defending inside the box Verbic Ilicic did well to win the ball back good distribution it's been given away here by Ronaldo so three minutes of stoppage time coming up Nice ball to switch the point of attack. And a timely intervention. Ivicic. And now it's 
it's all over and Portugal have made it through to the final here at the Euros. Well, it was far from easy at times. They'll certainly know they've been in a match today, but these are the sort of games you have to get through if you want to win silverware. They've done that and now they can turn their attention to that final. What a game that should be. Well, no getting away from it. The real catalyst for his side tonight, Cristiano Ronaldo. Well, he did everything today. His energy, skill and movement was just too good for those defenders. It was a really good display.